Yeah. I look like my face is about to explode, but that's fine. We are one step closer, and there are some nice views, not including my sister. Hello from Cycle. So, mask on because currently it's coronavirus a lot in Hong Kong. But apparently it is. Oh yeah, I don't know why I keep saying that. Anyway, so we are going to hike Sha Peak, one of the the most difficult hike in Hong Kong, which I'm really excited about. Hong Kong is in a lockdown during February 2020 over the coronavirus, and a lot of people are headed out to the countryside to hike and avoid the city center. To get to Sha Peak. Take bus number 94 from Saigon Town Center and get off at Oak Tao. So I'm using Wings Climb because it's better and we have started to hike to Shopee. So this is all concrete for now. Checking is part of the Megalihouse Trail Stage 3 and is a well-paved concrete trail that looks easier and shorter than it actually is. But it is very straightforward to follow. So we we're at a village. We're still on the trekking and on the way there. There's actually quite a fair amount of people that hike this trail. So yeah, we're just with other people and still hiking. The village trekking is by the sea, and you can get a ferry here from or to Wong Shek Mato if you want. This is the last bathroom of the hike. So public service announcement here. And trekking continues on. We finally left the village on the beach behind and the last highlight as well and going up towards Sha Peak and then we'll go to Hamtin Wan which is a beautiful beach but it is cold. Status report, we are still on the concrete road. It is so so hot now that we're kind of like speed walking. I took off my shirt as well. Whew. These are emergency phone for you to ask for help if you need them. I'm guessing this is where the path go up is. Ooh, I'm so, ooh, tired. From here, it feels more like a regular hiking trail on dirt path up and into the bushes until we emerge and finally see Sharp Peak. Clearly. Warning, the trail needs to Sharp Peak is very treacherous and difficult. Ha 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 ha. So, Sharp Peak is actually very treacherous. This is the way up and you will have to climb at some point. So I'll see if I can get videos of it. If not, it will be because I'm climbing. The uphill sections are very steep, but there are flat areas here and there where you can stop and catch your breath and drink some water. So, as you can see from my red face, it's been a steep track. Hi, people! So, yep, beach behind us. Don't forget to admire the beautiful beaches. So, it seems there are two ways up. I think that side looks easier than that side because that is a crazy dip. That's the destination. So this is basically what hiking shopping is like. This is not even the steepest part. Very loose, very rocky, so wear gloves. And um, bring water because look at my face, I'm overheated. The sections are easier than it look as long as you go slow and steady. If it has rained the day before, I won't go hiking here as it can get very slippery. So we are waiting at the famous photo spot, Hi Wing, to get some photos. We'll still see you. <laughs> the peak is mostly flat and people often sit and eat lunch here before setting off again. The viewpoint is just a little down here. Taking my way down. <laughs> Strange sound coming from this person. So we made it down from the first steep hike. So some of us are still hiking there. So that's Sha Peak and then now we are going to go all the way down to the beaches. There. It's a beautiful area to be in, and this stretch is easier to walk than the ones before and after, so I'll enjoy it while I last. So we have made it from Shaft Peak, and now we go to this one here. It's called My Fun Ben, which means rice noodle top. The descent towards the beach is long, because however high we went, we gotta go back down. So from Me Ben it's quite a steep way down. I am weirdly fast at it, but that's the only thing I'm gonna. If you're going down really slow, very slow, it's best to go on the side where the vegetations are because they will be grabbing onto the sole, so you're less likely to slip on gravel. Phew! We're still okay for now. Da, 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 da. We're uh, still going down and it is pretty steep still, 
Uh, we're gonna go down to the beach now. Uh, just really gotta be careful, but these are already better than the gravelly ground that we were on. Definitely wear your best hiking shoes to go down. Once we got down, we just followed the red orange ribbon that would lead us to Ham Tin Wan Beach. Um, of orange ribbon, so I just follow it and we're oh, no way out. From that route, we managed to make our way back towards Checking, which joins back to our starting point up to the Sharp Peak and eventually out. It sounds easy, but it's so long that I had to find a stick to help me go out. So we're now in this abandoned village, or semi abandoned. Um, we, oh, oh my god! <laughs> Wear gloves because we're going up there. Oh, okay. So, hi, this is Wes. Please. <laughs> yes, this is. Well, you just gave me a look. What look did you give me? Nothing. Yeah, I have a phone. So, we just came down from there. And it's super, super steep, but you can do it. Just stick to the vegetation. You'll be good. Don't run like him. That's like perfect.